everyone, my name is Mitz, and here we are about to enter inside Indigo Park, a new mascot horror game created by Unique Geese, before making this, has created a remaster of the first installment of the Garden of Ban Ban. After seeing that whole video and how it was made, and seeing how good it came out, and then seeing teases of this game being made in development, I was completely on board. Completely and utterly. Especially with the new mascot that's like front and center following along with us, I couldn't be any more happier. It looks like a great new way to take the mascot horror genre honestly further along. Oh, and I'm so, oh, so looking forward to this. But no more daily dallying. Let's take a nice little Nasada trip down this broken and abandoned amusement park. Isaac Indigo's. Welcome to Indigo For Park. All who journey to this newfound paradise, we welcome you. Indigo Park offers a slice of the American dream to call your own. In this place, echoes of days gone are brought back to life as a new generation captures a glimpse of the exciting potential of tomorrow. Indigo Park pays homage to the values, dreams, and unwavering truth that gave rise to our great nation. Here you embark on the journey of a lifetime, a <laughs> place of creativity, joy, and fantasy, where your dreams come Ah. That was the one thing, just noticing about this, like, it all seems like some more modern day too, so, ooh. Oh, we are, oh, we are definitely, uh, an Indigo Park fanatic, this whole family. Hey, Laura, I'm doing your adventures this weekend. What's it sucks? I'm gonna like, be careful, honestly, don't know what I'm gonna bring. I'm just gonna let them go, we're like, literally on our way just to break into the place then. <laughs> Oceanic Odyssey. Finley, come meet Finley at the Odyssey. Huh. Price your dream location. Local park sun closure. Indigo parks have vanished. Hmm. My God, just seeing like, oh, I love the like the cartoonish art style. Honestly, it's my big thing. There's a figurine in this place. Okay, so I love how this like park was made like in the more modern day before just being broken down, honestly, and abandoned. Oh, chapter one. Birds with a feather. Oh, that introduction was so great. Oh, it's so good. There's so many cool things about this already. Objective. Find a way into the park. Ooh, oh, it looks so good. Oh my gosh. If we just hop the fence. Okay, then. Huh. Looks like they were trying to pull up a lot of different like, concrete and maybe try to absolutely excavate it, like, get rid of it entirely, then? Hmm. What's the door, honestly? can't really probably it's definitely locked down though so to so take a more uh an answer suspected in through okay oh someone's already expecting us uh all right then well hopefully you got good context dude. oh my and god welcome to indigo park oh hi the most innovative and engaging family fun experience jump into the walls of your favorite character <laughs> wait you're our first guest in 2000. <laughs> days, 4 hours, 23 minutes, and 38 seconds. How, how many years is that? <laughs> I'm Rambly. Rambly the Raccoon. Hi, Rambly. And it's my job to make sure your experience here at Indigo Park is the most fun it can be. Just hop on over <laughs> to the registration center to your left, where our friendly assistant will help you begin your adventure oh. in the park. All right, then. Okay, nice to meet you, Rambly. If you're anything like your namesake, I'm pretty sure we're going to be best old buds then. So, press eat and interact. Okay, so Hi, here. I'm Rambly. Rambly the raccoon. Yes. And it's my <laughs> job to make sure your experience here at Indigo Park is registered. Let me just get a good... <laughs> just take you a photo. Hmm. You don't seem to have your face in our guest list. Is this your first time here at the park? No. Or did you just get plastic surgery? Many no layers. Worries. It's Rambly Tuesday. Rambly so you Tuesday. you qualify for a big discount on your visit. Just follow me to the main gate. I can't wait for you to see everything Indigo Park has to offer. No. Ah. Oh. Like he's absolutely adorable, honestly. Just seeing everything going along. Objective: Meet Rambly the park's main gate. Oh, it's gonna be so cool. Just like see him be like, <laughs> actually follow us all around. Like there's so many like little monitors and swings up all around the park. Then we're just gonna be interacting and talking to him all What's the right throughout. Up? The gate is open. Head on into the entryway. The blank hmm, stare. Hold on. My mistake. The gate is not open. Uh, yeah. There seems to be an error message being sent from the gate's power unit. Lucky you! 
Wow, you it looks like the solve it ourselves. To try our turn on the generator mini rambling venture. Wow, Have I'm so, wow, I'm so honored. Thank you so much. Okay, so the generator then if we're gonna do this all ourselves, like it makes sense you can't help us, you're not physical, which is very sad. It's already very sad, honestly. But let's so the generator's like inside there. Back right inside the little alcove in here. Oh, they opened this up. Okay, nice. The indigo violet compact power generator. It looks like it's turned on already. It seems to be inoperable. Looks like it's missing. A oh, it's a missing a gear. Can you find it? Let's see. Oh my god, it's a little plush. Oh my god, collectibles. Ah, oh, there's an information key. You have to learn more. Wait, like, is that actually like of these? Wait, hold on. Like, ah, oh. okay, it has to be somewhere like a different area. Maybe into the park. We actually look at the collector's items. Okay, so when you find a gear, then it's so, like it's either somewhere in this one room. Or, hmm, must be somewhere nearby then. A gear. Oh, there's one. Yoink. And just I'm gonna pop this in. There we are. Pull lever. Used to both hands. There we are. Oh, the, the entire power is back on. Nice. Like, how bright is it? Oh, it's in this room. Okay then. All right. We'll time to mosey on over to the gates. Okay, for real this time. Well Enter the new Disneyland. Indigo Park. It's our new Disneyland here. <laughs> Everything has been completely overgrown. Like, so many years have passed since people, like, went in here. I'm amazed not many people have broken in, try to steal all the plushies, honestly, and collectibles, honestly. <laughs> There's all, like, even already just seeing, like, some of the mascots, like, right here. Like, even, oh my god, even more plushies, honestly. Like, they are so well designed. So well designed. Okay, Wranglers only for... Yeah, for staff and that. So there's, everything is all broken oh, down. We need to then break through then somehow. Find, jump over. Critter, huh? That will allow you <laughs> access to reserve areas, charge payments to your room, and wear a Critter Cuff. I think there's some in the gift shop. Head in there and I'll get you set up. Welcome. I I'll, don't mind if I do. Like the critter cups with like little uh, bracelets. I am all for it. So, hmm. There you go, buddy. Your very own critter cuff. A new way to interact with Ooh. the park that it's also doubles bracelet. as a pedometer, heart monitor, and mood ring. Data disclosure agreement included. So, what am I feeling right now? I'm feeling uh, very purple right now. I'm. <laughs> well, I'm not tickled pink just yet. <laughs> Like, oh my uh -oh. gosh. The door mysteriously locked. Oh no. Why not test out your band and save the day? The, okay. Wait, how do you use the band then? Hmm. Oh, over here. Oh, to this, okay. Just have it get scanned, honestly. Whoa, hey, it's getting really bright. Work, buddy. <laughs> now try entering the park and we can start our indigo adventure. Hopefully I don't get my entire skin turned purple by the end of this. The color scheme is amazing. Okay, turnstile. Enter. I said enter. Oh, we have to keep scanning. There we go. Go through the turnstile. Nice. <laughs> I wonder who this person is. If there's a plaque for them or anything like that. Oh my god. It, it, they're just... They're staring at us. Are you going to turn around over here? No. I see how it is. To make your guests creeped out no matter where you go in the park then, huh? <laughs> it's bird up time. Oh my god. They're literally just putting in so many, just... <laughs> they're putting so many references in. That's amazing. Oh, well, okay, well, nice. We're stuck in here now. Well, uh, hopefully you're fine with living here for the rest of your life then, honestly. There's, uh, I would think there's worse places of him, uh, being stuck down here. We got free food, we got a lot of cu like, cuddly, um, uh, toys and all that to stay along. There's worse places to be, honestly. All right. So if that area is now completely just gone, then I guess we just look around and see if there's anything inside the restrooms here. Hello? Anyone around? Nope. 
Are there anyone else spelunking inside these O'Howd halls to help out here? And what, oh my god, it's a figurine. By the end of this, we're just gonna have an entire just a limited edition collection you can just sell on eBay. You're gonna be set. <laughs> <laughs> so if there's nothing we can't go in through these gates and doors and there must be Fire somewhere else test, oh. buddy looks like the park is going through some renovations yeah for the inconvenience your rambly tuesday discount will be free percent off free why not celebrate this great deal with a ride on my railroad <gasps> test your sleuthing skills i'll let you find this one all by yourself I well, shall then. Oh, okay, well, well, look at that. I, 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 I found it so quickly. Okay, from way far back, this statue looks so creepy, but up close, it's absolutely just completely adorable. <laughs> why are there? Why are there so many monitors right here? Like early drives of like, I guess Rambly being on the screen. Data oh. suggests you may be a bit older than the target audience for this ride. That's gonna be not gonna be issue. My favorite. Ooh. Do you know why Rambly the raccoon loves Rambly's railroad? Because train. Because I like trains. Exactly. See, look the look the special interest strike again. Love trains as a kid. Love them. Absolutely do. This is gonna be a blast. <laughs> Nothing's gonna stop me from enjoying this unless someone decides to break the ride. Shake fists. Everything's all it's pink. Huh. Oh my gosh. Dun -dun -dun. Oh, it's like a little splash mountain ride. Ooh. Oh Welcome hi. To Rambly's Railroad. I'm Conductor Rambly. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hi. Are you doing okay? Okay. You're just gonna follow us from screen to screen. Okay, gotcha. Oh, look! It's Molly the Cop! Hi, Molly! Molly yes, your mind's Molly. You, <laughs> you sure are, Molly. Why, you only crashed into six bars this week! <laughs> I'm not crashing, Rambling. I'm barnstorming! You're following the style. <laughs> What's barnstorming? Exactly, see? It barely hurts at all. Hopefully. Hey, those young adventurers you got along with you look like great pilots. Why not try your hand at flying in my ride? Rooftop racing. Admission included, we can critter Well, thankfully, this is free. Thank you so much. <laughs> I feel like a little kid again, honestly, now. Like little underwater ghosts. Oh, Finley, come on out and greet the people. Come on. Oh my gosh. Hi, Rambly. Hi, Rambly. Why the long face and body? Because he's a serpent. You've known me for 100 years, Rambly. <laughs> I'm always long because I'm always longing <laughs> for a new seashell for my collection. <laughs> oh, Finley, you should come out of your shell. How about you come into it instead? My ride, Oceanic Odyssey. Is this whole entire ride just a long, just <laughs> advertiser? It's as blue as me. We look more teal than honestly. Uh, I hope you'll visit. Don't worry, we'll Who's cheer you up. Just by Oceanic being there. Oh, we can't, we can't, I'm sorry, we can't visit you. I'm so sorry, gonna be lonely for <laughs> several more years. God damn it. Wow, I wonder what this used to be huh mm. okay whoa get the ride back up and running oh oh boy okay let's see so the if we had to get a star I'll start them running then it's like a jungle area so let's see it should mean they're generated in here let's see oh my god hi Okay, let's just get this up and running so we don't have to deal with that anymore. Oh, hi, Finley. Uh, okay. Okay, so the whole main thing in the game is just grabbing as many gears as we possibly can then. Let's see, there is one. There should be... Oh my god, it's, it's a little hat! Oh my god, I love it. Okay, so we got the two gears now. We put this all in. There we are! 
and everything should all be fixed and in shape. Rambly, are you fine? You don't sound too fine still all the way back here. It doesn't look like we'll be able to meet him, our newest, big, biggest buddy old pal right here, sadly. Ooh, the theater! Theater Lloyd. <laughs> shame me with that common folk name! I am the proud, the prestigious, Prestigious. The professional Lloydford L. Lyon, actor extraordinaire! I hate you can roll your R's better of than me. Of course it was! I'm the okay, okay, okay. Uh, bye, bye, Lloyd. <laughs> okay, we got, we got some beef here. Okay, then, well, uh, thanks for the ride, Rambly. <laughs> that was a blast. <laughs> okay. So, what do you think? Pretty fun, right? It was now extraordinary. You know all about my friends. And Lloyd. And Lloyd! So, where do you want to go? Uh. Oh, those are not places we need to go, so I'm, uh, let's go back on the train and go back. Oh my gosh, they have little, oh, they have Rambly, like, outfits, honestly. Oh my gosh, that's absolutely adorable. Oh, oh my the beanie hats, honestly. Uh uh. If we only like grab the figure like the collectibles, honestly, while through the ride and not in the gift shop, then wow. <laughs> That's one way to get out paying, honestly. Oh my gosh. Oh my. Oh, this whole area is so great. Oh <laughs> the fountain is like working properly, I guess. Man, this they did not do this place any justice they didn't do <laughs> everything was just almost completely tearing apart since the years have gone by then huh old alice's shake-ups lemonade hmm yeah even the more just going down here the more i'm getting reminded of actual disney world over here. oh over there uh okay rambly this here is an information kiosk ah oh. If there's anything around the park you want to ask me about, just stop by here and I'll ramble on about it. Yes, oh my god. Don't tell me you missed so many more of my already collectibles. Oh my gosh, I would love like just to see you ramble on and on. Like, I I, I do the same. I would love to hear you do the same. A <laughs> raction figure. It's the all-new Rambly the Raccoon Raction figure. Available at your local toy store. It's cool to see that some... That's, yeah. It's cool to see that there's some mint condition ones still in the park. Completely untouched. No one decided to come back. Molly plush. I remember my mom took us to the parks one summer. Her favorite was always Molly. So when they first opened the new Molly meet and greet in Jetstream Junction, we were some of the first in line. Oh, so your family is complete. Uh, uh, big fans of the place, huh? Rambly ears. I remember watching those old DVDs that Indigo would send to your house when you booked a reservation. They always advertised the biggest gift shops and made all these silly merchandise look so fun. My dad promised me he'd buy me a pair when we went. Did you ever get it? Because if you didn't, then I'm, uh, that's just complete robbery then. Rambly plush. Ah, there's my buddy. Kind of feels like Rambly has a whole empire now, being the man of Indigo and all. Well, hopefully, even though the music park is shut down, like, <laughs> Rambly has managed to live on outside of these, these walls and borders, honestly. All right, I definitely did not forget to actually select all these and get to Rambly, honestly. Definitely not, definitely not. Ignore that. Oh, oh, I got this. I know the commercial by heart. Look, it's a commercial? The figurine? Wow, it's the unlimited edition Rambly the Raccoon Raction figure. <laughs> push him down and he jumps. Push him up and he doesn't. Well, what the- do what? at your favorite toy store. Oh my god, that's amazing. Oh my god, it's a whole- <laughs> oh, oh, I love this already. Oh, so how do you feel about your uh, good old friend uh, having a plush? Oh, a Molly plush. She's always been my best friend. Aw. Did you know she builds planes in her landing pad at the park? And then she crashes them. She's so talented. As you do. As you do. It takes real talent to actually um, uh, successfully fly, but even bigger talent to purposely fail at it. Oh, <laughs> uh. uh, look, look, I just gotta know about the plush. Congratulations! You found me! Times two. Don't I look adorable? Look, you're already completely adorable, because again, like, literally, all raccoon characters I've seen, like, I, I kind of have an affinity for them, honestly. <laughs> They're just adorable, okay? You're, you're adorable, okay? 
Oh, the little ears being at. I would really? honestly buy that. <laughs> Those used to fly off the shelf. I can see. I can that see. That hair is pretty damaged, though. Keep your eyes peeled. There's got to be at least one more mint condition set out there somewhere. Like a yard sale. <laughs> well, there's already several at the... Well, there's already, like, several, honestly, at the gift shop. But I'm, uh, honestly, if, uh... If every single one of the years is in, like, in wear and tear, then I'm, uh... That's the closest we're gonna get then, huh? Uh, big, big sad. Hmm. I'm assuming these are two different flesh versions of Lloyd, or just, like, of him. It looks like another, uh, beanie or another there on the left. Quite a few other probably would get some more, uh, figurines or merchandise from the other mascots then, too. I'm already all so looking forward to it. It's like, I'm right in the middle of dead middle of night. Just walking straight down Main Street. Probably most of these areas are, like, completely, uh, shut down. Will this actually open? Nah. Probably need to, like, see if there's actually a, uh, a way to scan the, uh, <laughs> the Critter Cup, honestly. I so love that wow, name so much. That. You're at Jetstream Junction. Is it a minecart ride? Looks or? like Jetstream Junction's being tuned up. Aw. Last I checked, there's a security office in the back of the theater. Maybe a friendly wrangler can help you get in. So Lloyd's main stage. Oh my god. I love the I love these puns, honestly. So we need to find the Lloyd's main stage to get a key from a uh, staff. I like how like even like this bit in, we're mostly just about uh, having a grand old nostalgia trip with our best old good old buddy Rambly, honestly, just to steal the sights, honestly. And actually, if like uh, our character has been here like uh, a few times, honestly, before coming to this last excursion after the park is closed down, then a lot of things must have completely changed. If like even Rambly didn't recognize them, hmm. Little bakery or ice cream corner. Is that a oh okay, no, it's a the commemorative drink. I thought it was a Pez dispenser. <laughs> the donuts are still on display. Complete oh my god, those are completely rotten. I was wondering why these are okay, oh, these are display. These I'm up, these are the real local delicacy. Just put them all in a bag and start swallowing them. Don't even give them time to chew, honestly. Hmm. Yeah, let's probably close, honestly. Cafe de Raton Leo. <laughs> so, oh, is this? Oh, this is this is Lloyd's main stage. I'm sad you didn't put didn't put the main pun in there. How dare? How dare? Miss potential there from from the CEOs, honestly. Hmm. Wow, this whole place is actually really dark. Ooh. Oh, yeah, they fit the old antique vibe so well right here. So well. Oh. Hello? Is that Lloyd? Oh, oh. Oh. Well, okay. Okay. Well, if I'm, uh, looks like we're dealing with, uh, uh, Rambi's, uh, nemesis now. Oh no. We have to follow along with him, don't we? Gosh dang it. Uh, Rambly? Hey, buddy. I've got eyes all over the park, but I can't see anything behind the stage. If you're going back there, be careful. Your critter cup is not yet able to resuscitate you. Oh. <laughs> it's not able, but if you ever die in the future, honestly, we can have a CPR attached to it. <laughs> Start off for you again. Oh, if only the park is here longer. Oh no. Okay. Okay, looks like we have to get to the other side without getting attacked or mauled, clawed by a ma our not so big bud pal. Okay, why don't we just take things in slow? We don't want to be a problem, Lloyd. I would call you by your full name, but I completely forgot. <laughs> I don't want to give you the satisfaction anyway. Is that 3DS? <laughs> it's cassettes, but like, oh my gosh, they have 3DS games tied in with <laughs> the park. That's how good this park was before. All right, the whole area is blocked off. Then, a bunch of just journals and files just left behind. I'm gonna ignore that. Oh my god! Oh Jesus Christ! I turned it right around, actually. Okay. 
Uh, I thought I turned right around, but I went into a goddamn 360 U-turn then. Oh, jeez. Okay. A whole back area for this place than two with all the statues. Okay, okay. One step at a time. Okay, if this is where we need to go, then uh, I'm so glad Lloyd's all the way back there and not anywhere near here. Okay, we just grab the key and then go. Oh god, we probably have to, we have to walk our way back though. Oh no, oh no. There must be something in the. Oh, right here. This key. There we go. Use the key to unlock Jetstream Junction. Can do. I wonder if we could probably go back to these uh, other attractions, Oceanic Odyssey and Rooftop Races. Don't know if there's a set order, like, you're allowed to go into some of these attractions, honestly, where you have to go to the, these areas, actually get a key or anything like that, but I'm, uh, I guess we'll find out was, ooh, after we get through to Jet Dream Junction, then. Okay, oh no, I hope Lloyd did not manage to get past those, uh, crates. Go storage. That's where it came from. Okay, you just stay on that side of um, your little box fort, okay? We'll be on this side. We're the lowly peasant to um, uh, your complete, uh, <laughs> to your empire, your highness. Oh gosh. Uh, I cannot see him anywhere. Uh,. Okay, we're right there. Um, I'm making a break for it. Over the tarp. Okay, let's go. Okay. Okay, he hasn't followed us. Okay, just get through. Just get through. Just get through. Oh my god! What? We can tase you with that? Yeah, go away! Okay, he immediately fled. Okay, uh, scan again. Let's go. You stay back there. All right, then. Okay, uh, we're back into your watch while I now rambly. Okay. Well, we got the key. Hope you're proud of us. Uh, let's get Al down out of here now. Oh, uh, not worth the price of admission. Yeah, even though, like, without, like, the... Well, there's some small, like, um, for performance issues. Like, besides, like, just um, uh, the severing between. Like, honestly, this is already really good. It's so well done. Even as, like, a, like one of the first games, like, they've made, honestly. This is a really good first attempt. Oh, there's already so much drama, honestly. I wonder if we can get into the grandfather clock and set time back to normal. Uh. All right then, Rambly. It took a lot of doing facing up against your mortal enemy, but here we are. It's now unlocked. Let's go right back inside. Say, why don't you check out Molly's rooftop races? Oh, it's, it's not a... far from here. Huh. It's a great warm up before we get into the bigger rides. Just take an up at Molly's landing pad. All right, then. I didn't realize this is a, a multi-stage like stage area. Oh, this is all about her, then. Like, oh, there's several different areas for her. Oh, this is all about her, then. Okay, then. So, rooftop races, landing pad. I Yeah, actually, I'll, I'll go along with you, Rambly. Just go to the, the landing pad and just like, ride all the way up, then. If we can even get through. Apparently not. <laughs> I wonder if you can actually just make your... <laughs> well, I doubt you can make your own exact card, honestly, but like, oh my god, like these? That'd be, that'd be really dope. Oh, the garage is like, is a food place. Oh, it's thematic. Oh, I love it. If it it's just like, like an old hangar around here. All the steel beams and the metal, honestly. Oh, it's also nice, actually, also nice. Well, what, kind of, what kind of bird up drinks do you have here? You got bird up, you got Kohler, you got water, you got Dr. Muncher. 
<laughs> and uh is that diet water oh my god they have everything they have absolutely everything here people are missing now by closing this place down weren't they <laughs> Oh, Rambly drinks and Pez dispensers. Ooh, an arcade machine. Immediately grab, yes. Oh my god, is it actually a mini game here? Ooh, nice. Oh my god. Oh no, Molly's plane crashed somewhere in Rambly Woods. I better find her and make sure she's okay. Free play. Oh, oh my god, it's a nice little like 3D little 2D platformer. Nice. Okay, so that's the jump. Nice. Ooh. I I <laughs> Glad to see that even raccoons can't swim. Okay. Okay, so we just gotta get to the end of this without hitting any of the rivers then. Make sure you don't get your cotton candy in a twist, really. Uh, I've seen those videos. Oh! Ah, it's like literally just like a Mario platformer. Okay, just gotta make sure to get up there. Ooh, we got a double jump then. Nice! A little sl Sly Cooper action, just doing a little somersault in the air. Nice. <laughs> You just gotta make sure to collect all the actual raspberries, not strawberries. You see, technically these would be strawberries, but my son's playthrough is anything to go with it. Okay. The environment here is actually so well done. Aw, aw, adorable. At least some of the enemies here are having, are having a good time. Okay, okay, down the stump pipe then. Oh. Okay, so we're just going right over the mountain then. Nice. Dun, dun, dun. This entire game is so charming, honestly, from all this. Like, this is really fun, honestly. Ooh. Just moseying along through the woods. Oh! Molly! What happened? Oh, pix the pixel sprites of them are great. Uh, hi, Rambly. I was flying through the woods, but suddenly I couldn't see a thing. Did you crash into their barn or somewhere else? What? Oh. Hello? Salem. Looks like my smoke screen made her crash right on target. It was your plan, Salem. I should have known you are behind this, you shady skunk. Let her go. Nah. What do you mean, nah? How's about I try my new potion on? On her instead, entire wasted on squirrels. Squirrels. Molly, look out! No! Oh. Oh, that's what caused them to go like that. Oh. No! Molly! Too slow, dumpster face! What did you do to her? Meet the new and improved Molly Macaw. Now, with none of that friendship garbage stopping her from tearing you to pieces, no, the power of friendship is failing us here. I wonder what she really thinks of you now. Have fun finding out. Oh, yay. Oh, okay. Ah, just gotta make sure we just keep stomping at her then. It's like a little, like, little boss fight here. Oh my gosh. Oh, that was easy. Wow, okay, that's... Wow, that's so loud. Holy God. Uh, what, what? Oh my gosh, we're seeing things. This is the new AR experience then, right? <laughs> that's a collectible. Okay then. Well, that was fun actually. So if we can't get to the landing pad then, the next, we, can, we can only probably just go to rooftop races then. It's like right above the landing pad, so hopefully that I'm uh that's the next best thing in, in to go along with you then, Rambly. Oh no! Oh no! It's horrible! Oh, it's all broken down! Uh, looks like Molly crashed into the light again. Don't worry though, your pal Rambly has the repairman on speed dial. Well, hopefully someone I'm uh Will anyone pick up? We're sorry. Oh, I feel so bad for him, no honestly. Is that fair, Please sweet? Check the number and <laughs> dial again. Uh, say, why don't you check out Molly's landing pad? It's not far from here, and it's a great <laughs> cool down after that exhilarating ride. Just take a down from Molly's rooftop races. 
All right then, Rambly. Uh, he's like, he's trying so hard to appease us, honestly. Oh, it's absolutely kind of adorable. Again, I still, um, oh my God, what is this? Oh my God, new plush. Don't know if like it's, a, I don't think it's a mask that we've seen before. It just looks like I'm a, a poodle character. It was Molly McCaw. And then, I don't know, like, Percy the Poodle or something like that. So, okay. Oh, I did not realize that was there the entire time. Well, here we go. Straight into the landing pad, then. Oh, my God. Oh, my. Oh, my God. Well, ignore that. This is in my happy fun times. Nothing else. Sick beat, actually. Oh, wow. Oh my god, we can actually turn all these around. Wait, what? Wait, the, everything just went darker, did it? Hmm. Don't know if actually moving those around actually, like, uh, sh changes anything else, but, like... Ooh. This is a nice little kid's play place, honestly, right here. Whee! <laughs> So I'm assuming we have to open this up, we have to move one of these around a certain area? Or then move one of these around to a certain symbol? To a star. Oh my god. Uh. Fantastic start. Alright. Well, Rambly, I hope you're, uh... Your screen just somewhere in here because uh I don't want to be alone with whoever else is in here at all. I mean, th these tubes and little monkey bars all throughout the jungle gym of this entire kitty maze. Uh oh hi. Hello? I think we got our first look at Molly. Alright. Well, I don't know how you're taking up. I'm, uh, your resident here, Molly, but I'm, uh, your bestest, uh, pal Rambly is here to help keep you company then, right? Hopefully. Oh no, where's that music coming from? In this direction? Is this where the exit was, or... Oh, we're back to the start then. There has to be something we can do with those four cubes. Spin them to a different symbol, or what have you. We went down that way, down that tube. We got on these staircases then. Hmm. Oh! Oh! It's a trampoline! Uh, okay. We just go to, uh, oh, we just died. Okay. <laughs> the ball pit is dangerous. The floor is lava. Okay. I swear, if we get, we just get stuck into a never ending, just, uh, like, tube maze, honestly. I'm not gonna be having it. Like, these were ominous enough as kids, honestly. Ooh, okay, so green... Okay, so that's the symbols we need. Green triangle for that. Okay, so... We have to head up here then. Green triangle, green triangle. Okay, let's go up. There we are. Up. Can we even get up there like that? Jump higher? One more time? No, not like that. Hold on. Do your jumping prowess. There you go. Okay, green triangle, blue star... Blue star. Okay, gotcha. Hi, Molly? You're just watching us, honestly, aren't you? You want to see if we actually be able to solve this, I guess? Okay. It was a green triangle. Blue star. There we are. I don't think we saw anything for... A yellow and red, did we? Unless it's done the other way, which I did not notice. I need to get, take another look. Okay, so there's a yellow circle right before we go back down to the beginning here. 
So, even if we don't know what red is, or completely skipped over it, it should be easy to guess then, right? So, if it's going to be all different, then one of these, it should be a different... There it is! There we go, we solved it. Alright then. Well, we're definitely going to be seeing Molly McCaw real soon. So, hopefully we can, like, jet off real quickly. Oh, God. No, this is, this is the most ominous thing ever. Okay. Just go down the, the slide one at a time. Ugh. I'm in the thick of it now. What is this for? Oh, the music? Wait, it just stopped. Is this is a doorbell? It just plays a little jingle and nothing else then. Hmm. Oh, it just opened this door then? Okay. Okay, that's closed off. I need to go this direction then. It's gonna open up. Oh, hi. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Go down. Uh, left. Jesus Christ. I don't know what's been going on since and since everyone's abandoned all of y'all, but like we're not going to be next to the chopping block. Come on, go up. Let's go left. I already heard her in, in the tube, honestly. Just keep going after. Okay, uh, hopefully one of these break, honestly. Come on. Mm. She is really fast her feet. Jump. Ah, oh, goddammit. She's chewing up the entire place to get through. It's like her little nest. Oh, god, she's already going after us. She's already right there. Oh, no. Crap. Oh, my god. She just pecked her fucking face out. You were caught by Molly McCaw. Molly can repeat words that she's heard. Don't be fooled. <laughs> Round two, then. Nope. Okay. We're not going to become next on the menu there. Oh, God. I can hear already all right behind us. Mm. Right back through the broken fence. Hopefully none of these are a complete dead end, honestly, for us. We just don't get stuck right where her, her nesting grounds are. Okay, come on. Okay, right here. She's gonna be, like, directly right on her heels. Oh, god. Everything's all been broken up. Oh, no, we're in the back area now. Oh, those are collectible. <laughs> I missed it. In the vents now? Oh, she's right there. Uh, no. She's, like, crawling straight after us. God damn it. There must be something to stop her. Right? Uh, Rambly, help! No, well, guess what? We're going to become part of staff. Thank you. Open the door. Oh. Uh. Welcome to the Rambly's Wranglers Registered Room. Here we got plenty Thank of you, amenities. Rambly. Uh, okay, okay. I can see in your facial tracking that you're scary, scary upset. Transparency is an important part of our policy here at Indigo Park, so I think we need to be honest about something. The park has been inactive for years. And oh. showing up. I guess, too, the mascots are... I just was so excited to see a visitor. No, I completely get it, Rambly, but, uh... <laughs> but I was confined to the entrance for so long, I didn't realize just how much disrepair the park has fallen into. Ugh. <sighs> Wasting all of your fun time. No, even besides getting attacked like that, this is all been fun. But, but, I have an idea. 
I have access to the repair documentation in my database. I just can't execute most tasks without authorization from a human Wait. user. You must have come here because the park matters to you too, right? Are we gonna join up? Are you willing to help me restore the park? Yes. I can see in your facial tracking data that you aren't opposed to this. Yes. Oh, I'm so excited. Let's get this place back in business. Well, I'm, uh, I guess if we if we're gonna help our favorite park out, then I'm uh, dealing with that as I guess a uh, part of the new job. Oh God, she had so much blood coming out of her. Ah. Uh. So much blood. Yeah, but no. Okay, welcome to the crew. Rookie I'll be on part of the, the plan, Rambly. The first official job is one of Rambly's Wranglers. Register is to Register. get out of the Rambly's Wranglers Register. room. Uh, Head left towards the Rookie Wranglers Register. Security room to set yourself free. Phew, kind of exhausting to say that whole spiel. But Rambly's Wranglers Register is a registered <laughs> trademark. That expired yesterday well then you don't have to say anymore then you can just just say staff or just call us a wrangler then if we're already immediately gonna be helping out with the park registration then i'm uh, making sure everything gets uh disrepaired oh dear, dear god i just realized you probably have to sweep and get rid of all these boxes then oh no oh no but if we can help anything else out i'm uh if we can make sure like the the park gets up to speed again with that i'm uh the rest of the world, like, falling along in a circle uh -oh. just to help Wrangler's with her. Oh. Wrangler's room is only accessible by royal wranglers. Royal? Maybe one day you'll grow up big and strong enough to enter it. <laughs> but for now, don't. Don't? Uh, what? Do we need another critter caller then? Okay. Well, okay then, uh, I guess we'll just follow along with your lead then, uh, rambly, honestly. Please tell us your lock is in here until this whole park is uh, completely fixed up, please. Please. Oh, we're right in the security room. Why is all the different areas around the main street? The gift shop. Yeah, down the street. Like I even saw the grandfather clock over there. I think this is a fountain too. Man, we already kickstarted the entire place. Such as sitting at the one generator at the beginning. Alright then, uh, so Rambly, the second we get out of here, what's the first thing, uh, we need to go and do then? Do we need to go to, don't tell me we have to go back, all the way back to Lloyd and, like, make sure that place is completely done. Let's go somewhere else. Can we? Can we? Oh, this looks like a whole complete medieval section. Oh, in the pirate area. Oh. Oh, it's that part of the, of the, the railway ride that we weren't able to see. Oh no. I can't believe I missed the last information kiosk on the very last stretch of the game. Well, just to make up for it, I actually went back and actually got the rest of the collectibles through the rest of the chapter. There's gotta be some juicy stuff in here, right? Starting off with the Poodle Plush. It's a weird Poodle Plush. It doesn't seem to be an Indigo product. Sure, it doesn't look like any character you see in the parks. Maybe a shot left it behind? Hey, buddy, did you dig that out of the lost and found? Or was it in the trash? It was just on a, no a couch. I was surprised that our park would dispose of a non indigo brand toy. No. I suppose he'd make playtime special for a child with poor taste, though. <laughs> I think what makes it even funnier just from that, actually, uh, I think it's actually a reference to, uh, I think, Playtime with Percy. This is like a. Uh, like a, a FNAF fan game almost, with like, the Percy as the main thing, with a little Motomagachi as like one of the main gameplay cells. Like, oh, that was fun to watch, honestly. I can't believe we referenced that. Does that mean like all these are references, like besides some, uh, I guess some the plushes on a series here, like some of these are <laughs> actually game references? Rambleberry, this thing popped out of the Rambly Rush arcade cabinet. How is this even possible, AR? Do you think it's edible? Well, hopefully you don't get pixelated and just <laughs> game over it into the nether. Whoa, where'd you get that? Rambleberries are my favorite! Oh. Oh, if only I could jump out of <laughs> the screen and take a big bite. Don't eat it! Maybe I'll be able to one day! <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, we could just put an emo or something and digitize it, I guess. If it came from the arcade machine, I'm pretty sure we could give it right back, honestly. Oh, good God. Oh, good gosh. Oh, this is fantastic. Souvenir cup. When I was a kid, they used to have free unlimited refills on these things. I once drank so much bird up that they got sick and threw up while riding rooftop races. That poor kid behind me. Well, sucks to be them then. Ooh, that's a rambly cup. Rambling Nothing on and on. Nothing beats the taste of fresh rambleberry juice Raspberry? directly out of my plastic <laughs> lifeless egg. <laughs> 
Oh my god, oh, I swear, like, this entire, like, the full release of the game actually does not have some way of a ma. Uh, literally making sure this entire park is completely fixed, or we just put Rambly on a, like, a flash drive and, like, bring him home with us, then I'm, uh, I will riot. I will riot. <laughs> uh, like, is this a little mask? Oh, it's a head. Rambly head. Whoa, freaky. Let's see one of those mascot costumes that used to, used to use the parks in a weird way. I'm kind of glad they retired these. Yeah, if they're like completely have no eyes, like right there. Uh, yeah, possibly so. Uh, you only just see the performer's eyes behind it. That's creepy. Immensely so. Whoa, where'd you find that? I've never seen anyone wearing one. Pretty snazzy. <laughs> Ooh, looks like there's an what? audio recording tagged with costume in my database I've never noticed before. Let's costume. listen. Let's listen. Hey, Jackson, you hear about the new mascots? Yeah, think it'll put us out of a job? I think so. Old sport. <laughs> and right sport. after we got this damn raccoon costume. Man, screw this place. <laughs> I said we get our asses out of here and go straight to Vegas. Oh! Oh, come on. <gasps> they didn't even document the Indigo inventory ID for the costume. Oh my god. I'm really looking forward to that. What a useless recording. Deleted. No! Oh my god. I can't believe they put a Daisy of Freddy's reference in there. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, oh, this is just it feels like an entire love letter to mascot of horror now. Oh, this is oh, I love it. Okay, so the, 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 there's a gold Rambly plush. Don't tell me this is really the this Kane's version of Golden Freddy then. Oh no. So wait, they were so money hungry that they just recut Rambly and called a new product. Kind of lazy, don't you think? Oh, you should probably see all the new plushes, honestly, of all the FNAF characters. I would honestly buy like a rainbow, like rainbow tie dye Bonnie, honestly. Wow, is that a limited edition gold Rambly plush? Limited edition? We're fighting tooth and nail for those things when they came out. How rare are they? Me, our employees had to clean up so many straight teeth and nails. It's hard to believe there was all that demand for a regular Rambly plush we just blasted with gold spray paint. Yeah. Oh my God. It looks like when this came out, it was just giant Black Friday sale. Honestly, everyone scrambling grab it. Oh yeah, like, I completely forgot his name was actually Finley. That's a plush of him. The sea serpent always kind of freaked me out. How dare. He's shy like Eeyore. Give him a chance. I love aquariums and fish, but the size of him always made me feel uneasy as a kid. Size. Oh, you found my buddy Finley. You know, he's really shy. Like, too shy. Too shy? Like, obnoxiously the, shy. Okay. <laughs> but he's got a good heart. I hope you get to meet him someday. Uh, someday, I guess. Maybe way down the line, hopefully. Okay, we already got these two in the middle, and oh boy, oh boy, Lloyd plush. I feel like as a kid, Indigo used Indigo used Lloyd a lot more. He was always my favorite. Oh no, oh no, we got jealousy gonna be on hand. Let's see. You, <laughs> you, nothing else more to say. Just. You, what happened between you two? Oh, it's a retro Lloyd plush. I just find it weird when companies make merch that's supposed to look old. Lloyd obviously had an older look in the classic Indigo cartoons. Yeah, okay, so it's cartoons. This is not just like the park was made and all this. It's literally just this world's Disney World. Yeah. Lloyd obviously had an older look in the classic Indigo cartoons, but I'm not sure it looked like this. I guess nostalgia sells. Yeah, I guess it's modernized up. Nostalgic bait. Why do they only make one of Lloyd? Is it because he's the loudest? I can be loud too! Uh, We're uh, uh, edition throwback plush! We're Spinleys! Uh, We're Spinleys! Okay, I understand. Child and they'll cry. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. I, I hope there is way much more on the collective side, honestly. Just <laughs> randomly just being the biggest hater of Lloyd, honestly, for whatever reason. Oh, I love it. Oh, I love it. But that's all the collectibles. Time to continue along in the rest of the game. Oh, we're, this is the Oceanic Odyssey. Well, don't worry, little wow, buddy. We'll you keep you... Oceanic Odyssey. You're doing a great job, Rookie Wrangler. Yeah. We're going to keep uh that old eel all funny and busy. You'll find a puffer and porpoises, pickles, and perches as far as the eye can see. Please don't tap the glass. Really Just smash flashlight. Oh, oh. Hi. I completely forgot the eel's name, but 
Oh. Buddy, you okay? You look kind of tired. Do you need a moment? Oh. Don't worry, it's fine. I don't blame you for taking a rest after all that. Heck, I could go for a nice, relaxing defragmentation myself. <laughs> but before you settle down, you up for a little survey to help us improve the park? Thanks for visiting in the oh, park. Kidding. Hope all your dreams came true. Mm -hmm. If you've got some time and you're up for a lark, stick around for the rambly review. I'm here to offer my best to each valuable guest I assist. And lots of happy feedback ensures I get to exist. Mm -hmm. Were you satisfied with the rides? Yes. yes. Were you satisfied with your guide? Sure yes. Do you plan to come back? Will I see you again? Yes, your yes. Experience convince you to tell a friend about us. Mm -hmm. Did I earn your trust? Maybe. At Indigo Park, there is a stark contrast to everything I know this place should be. Oh. Of the dark you've given a spark of sunshine to this kingdom's faithful devotee at indigo park more than my remarks are mysteries even i don't know what we might find but fight through the dark and i'll be your spark of sunshine <laughs> to get you If you want to keep going No, definitely Idea. I know all of this isn't fair to you It's an awful lot to ask But here You're comes putting a lot on this one guy two, To sell you on our task I'm here to view and assess Each valuable guest as I learn And lots of happy feedback Ensures you're gonna return right. I'm so happy you wrote a ride I'm so happy to be your guide More than you know so come back anytime, I'd love to see you again In all my thousands of days, I've never had a friend like you At least I hope I do At Indigo Park Indigo Park There is a stark contrast to everything I know this place should be But out of the dark You've given a spark of sunshine to this kingdom's faithful devotee Indigo Park More than my remarks are Mysteries even I don't know what we might Find <laughs> But fight through the dark And I'll be your spark of Sunshine to get You out of any Bind Till all my old friends are United again and I won't Feel so left Behind you go see you next time buddy oh Please? you will yes i will come back rambly oh my gosh that was a really nice ending song honestly oh 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 thank you indigo park is a full-on passion part that we've been working on for a little over a year now the stories and the world that we wanted to create with rambly and his friends are very special to us for the scale of this game we're gonna need some help if you enjoyed your experience of Chapter 1, please consider supporting our soldiers if you want to see Chapter 2. Ah, uh, yes, I immediately saw before going through this game that a like, Kickstarter was made. And bef right before just um, uh, starting this, uh, <laughs> starting recording this, literally, the Kickstarter was completely funded. I was planning to go and check it out, honestly, and give my own money, honestly, if everything, like, looked out. <laughs> but, like, yeah, oh, oh, yeah, this is just, this is really fun. Even, like, uh, just as a first, like, a uh, game being made honestly like as a complete amateur game dev honestly from all of this it looks really nice it looks really nice sure there might be like some small performance issues but like you can like iron those out as you get like more experience honestly and teasing around with them uh the engine and just um uh, processing rendering like there there are there has some really like cool stuff right here honestly there's some really good potential here especially with them uh Again, with just like I'm having a character like rambling around, actually following along, like at like being there to help along the main player, like both either to like get out or escape, or in like in this game's case, a more interesting way is like to stay in the park to actually help make sure that I'm uh everything's up and running. And just from the like sound of that, and maybe by the end, unless there's some big new like villain, honestly, that there's around here skulking around besides the main mascots, then then. It looks like this just looks like this is gonna have a nice lighthearted ending, honestly. And just <laughs> uh 
like immediately already just grew attached to Rambly, honestly, before this happened. And just even just hearing him talk, honestly, just leading around and like, ah, oh, like, like he's innocent being, honestly, just completely innocent being, honestly, don't know how <laughs> he's been there for so long in the entrance way for over a year. And now finally that he gets a chance to see the rest of the park from uh, our help, honestly, and just sees how everything is in complete disarray. Like, why wouldn't you help out? Why wouldn't you help him out? Why wouldn't you? But this has actually been a very, actually enjoyable experience. It's been really fun. Really fun. I'll probably be going out to the Kickstarter page right this and, and offering some money, honestly, up to help fund it, fund it some more. You know it's been completely fun by this point. As of me recording this right now, I would love to see where this goes and make sure it has way more of a budget, honestly. Anything that makes the, like, the experience any more better or like, adds more stuff, honestly, is well worth my opinion. Well worth my opinion. Oh boy. I'll leave a link to the description for the Kickstarter in the description below so y'all can check it out and maybe hopefully pledge your own money to it because I, I sincerely do think this game definitely has, it has a lot of them, uh, cool ideas in here which i love to see come to fruition way down the line way down the line and i'll be here waiting every step of the way but with that that'd be a good time to lead things off for right here so hope fun time watches as i have been playing this hope you see me next time whatever time that may be and i all hope you fantastic day